effective for the prevention and treatment of nausea and vomit caused by VR dizziness? I wonder if that'll work with council games too. If so, you know what that means, geeks? Game on! So I went ahead and purchased the anti-nausea watch thing from Amazon. And in the box, I got some cleaning packets, two of them, a business card, a little letter that tells you how to use it, and the actual device. So those of you that have been watching the channel for a while and may have Rewatched some of our live streams where Jeremy and I game may have noticed that I sometimes disappear for a while That's because some console games make me nauseous now I bought this in hopes that it'll work when I get motion sick from The console games because there's many games that I want to play that I can't play because I get motion sick And have to stop or I feel like I want to die in real life not just in the game So the game plan is I'm going to wear this and hopefully set it up correctly and try playing games that I know make me motion sick both console and VR and see if it helps so I can play the games that I want to play and if it does great I'll let you know if it doesn't I'll still let you know but it also means that I wasted the money to buy it so hopefully this works because there's a lot of games that I've been wanting to play that I can't play because I just want to die afterwards. Let's go to the gaming montage and I'll see you at the end. The Emiderm Anti-Emetic for Nausea, I actually would recommend for gamers out there that do get motion sick from some of the video games they play. It seemed to especially work well with the Oculus or Metaverse or whatever you want to call it, the Meta. I got it when it was Oculus, I'm still going to call it an Oculus. I was able to play several games that I was only able to not even make it through the intro before. I, even on the Xbox, I was able to play Kingdom Hearts, which I was only able to play for a short period of time before feeling nauseous. I did start feeling a little bit of nausea while I was playing Halo, but I started playing with a migraine already. So I think it was more related to the migraine than the motion sickness. I also started to feel off while playing the roller coaster game on the Oculus while trying to shoot targets. 
it was a little bit too much for me at that point. But again, that's a game that I was only able to play part of the intro before trying this out. That being said, it does feel like it's burning a little bit while it's on. I don't know if that's just me. It's not really a pain, it's just more of a discomfort. If you're willing to go through that, it didn't leave any marks on my skin when I played it, which is a good thing. It means that it wasn't actually burning, it just felt like it was going to leave a mark when I took it off, but it didn't. A lot of the reviewers say that it falls off. I feel like the longer band works better. Um, I also don't use this as it's intended, which is to put it in there. I kind of use it, the peg more as a stopper for that, so it won't come loose. I did lose it once. I wore it to bed just to see if I would lose it there. And I wore it two different nights. I only lost it the second night in bed. But wearing it around to walking dogs, I didn't lose it while doing that. All in all, if you have problems playing video games or are going on a cruise like I am, I was just picking this up. I think it worked well. And I'm thinking that I'll be able to actually play some of the video games I haven't been able to play due to getting motion sick partially through the intro. I don't think it's perfect. I give it a four out of five stars just because I do still, after a while, not so much the nausea, but I do feel it in my eyes, like a strain in my eyes, like I'm going to get motion sick if I keep playing, but I still think it helps. This, by the way, is not sponsored. This is just something that I'm like, hey, it says I can play Oculus without getting motion sick. That sounds amazing. I, there's so many games on there that I want to play, but I can't, can't because I get sick. So I'm excited to wear this more often while I'm playing. And I'll leave a link down below if you want to try it for yourself. When I bought it, it, was on, it had a coupon. So it went down to like $99. Don't know if the coupon's still there, but I will definitely leave you a link. So you could try it out yourself. It comes also, if you don't like the light blue, it does come in black as well. So if it works for you, let me know in the comments below. And until next week, later geeks.